Okay, guys, here we go. I asked you guys a question. I said, ask me a question about Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Ask in the replies. We'll answer in the video. Please retweet. So duh, duh, duh. I want to go from the first to the last. So I guess this would be the first one. No, that's seven hours ago. I, I don't get it. 16 hours, 16. Okay. I'm, I'm just going to go from the bottom to the top. All right. Does this game have potential to be one of the best cards? Um, yes, it does. But it it's not likely going to be one of the best cards because the maps, if the maps are like the maps in the beta, which two of the maps I didn't really mind, to be honest. Uh, the the cave map i didn't mind it once you start learning the cave once you start learning the camp spots i don't mind that map and the other map gun rusher gun runner i don't mind that map either but the other map hackney yard is by far the worst map one of the worst maps it's worse than it's one of the worst maps i played since world war ii it, it's uh, it has a big spawn problem and that has to be addressed all right next question how long do you see this game lasting before it's considered trash for me black ops 4 lasted three months like i said about the maps before if the maps are good i see it lasting a strong seven months but if the maps are bad i see it lasting if it lasted three months for you in black ops 4 i see it lasting five months because black ops 4 is, is by far the worst boots on the ground game period next question uh by t-pone brad and elite sensei was the first two but t-pone asks what is one absolute that needs to be added to this game uh for 6v6 gunshots on the mini map since you added the mini map since you added the mini map you might as well put gunshots on it so people could feel good about themselves about using a silencer and stuff like that that's one thing i don't know about ground war and stuff like that next question bruce strictly rush i would like to hear your opinion that's all i ask because i think the map design even the audio is bad I like everything else. I can't see myself buying it with these maps. I agree with you, but I am a content creator and I stream this shit and I'm just happy that it's a modern shooter with boots on the ground and it's not robotic and colorful and stupid, you know? So I'm just excited for that and I'm wishing for the best that it has good maps but if you're just a normal guy i wouldn't buy it either with the maps you know you know till i see like one of us post it and be like oh shit that map looks lit you know i understand that next question my homeboy a flying modem this is one of my biggest supporters in the um live stream also so i show love on that thank you man um I don't really like the maps. How do you feel about the maps? The first, I, like the, like I said earlier, those two are good. And um, that one map is fucking garbage. I hate it. I hate that map. Um, his next question, I'm gonna let him ask too cause he's VIP. <laughs> I just made that up. But do you think time to kill is too fast? Yes, I think time to kill is too fast. It's way, it's not way too fast, I think. They should boost it up to like Black Ops 2 or Modern Warfare 3, something like that. I think they had it spot on. Uh, I like that when you shoot, you die, but that rewards the campers a little bit too much. Not boost it up to Black Ops 4 where it's just ridiculous, you know, but they got to boost it a little bit or nerf all the guns and y'all don't want to do that. Next question. 
How does Time to Kill feel by David? Uh, would you suggest Tweaks Hair? Yes. I just talked about that. I think Time to Kill is perfect. Man, shut your dumb ass up. He ain't asking you. All right, next question. Describe the entire beta experience in three words. It was all right. That's three words. <laughs> next question. Can I tweet? I like his name. How can ground war improve? That mode is cheeks. I didn't play it much, so I'm not going to lie. I don't know. Next question. Sega City. Overall map quality, 1 to 10. Sorry my lions got you. Yeah, Eagles are playing garbage right now. We're missing our two starting wide receivers and our defense is trash, so whatever. But um, map quality, 1 to 10. I give it, I give 1 to 10. All right, so the cave map, 1 to 10, I give it a 6. Gun Runner, 1 to 10, I give it a 7. Hackney Yard, 1 to 10, I give it a 3. Because it's a bad map. All right, next question. My hit detection felt way off the first weekend. Or have I just got tired old as eyes? <laughs> I hit detection wasn't a problem for me, to be honest. See, note. Next question. RMD87 Rasul Give me three reasons you like the beta Modern um, It's better than Black Ops 4 And uh, huh, That's about it I got two reasons Next question Vargas How much is Activision paying you I wish they were paying me because I'm honest regardless if someone's paying me or not in the in the in the contract it has to be I have to be honest you know and yes I can look, put the link in the description and shit but I have to be honest period that's how I was with anything I was ever endorsed with next question how is PC compared to console? On the fence on which one I should play on. Didn't get a chance to play on PC. Oh, what up? What's up, Grenade? Um, <clears throat> PC looks better than console, but the players are way better. It's, it's just, it just is what it is. The players are way better. And in, in the mixed matchmaking, uh, PC gets matched with PC more than it gets matched with console. Sometimes you might get a PC, a console lobby. Like me, I was getting all PC lobbies like forever. And then a console lobby did all PC lobbies. So it runs better on PC. It looks better on PC, but the players are way better on PC. And I'm sorry, like, you know, like, I think a good ass player on console will beat a good player on PC in this matchmaking because of the, I was going to say hit detection. What, what is it called? The aim assist, but it's way more casuals in console than it is on PC for the simple fact that if you buy a PC, you're going to spend $2,000. And if you're spending $2,000 on gaming, you better be fucking serious that's the way i look at it that's my analogy so yesterday i asked should red dots appear on the mini map when gunfires occur 6v6 only not large scale warfare like ground war because the mini map would look crazy if they do it in ground war and 80 percent yes 20 percent no and proxy wrote a book but and that's it. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Rate, comment, subscribe. Hit the alert bell. I will have a thoughts video up as my next video. I don't know if it's going to be tomorrow or the day after. But thanks for watching, y'all. I'm out. Peace.